Go Starliner. Godspeed, Butch and Sonny. And with that, the Boeing Starliner capsule blasting off into space from Cape Canaveral in Florida. Although Elon Musk's SpaceX had made nine trips for NASA since 2020, it is Boeing's first time taking a crew into space. Aboard today, two veteran NASA astronauts, Barry Butch Wilmore and Sonny Williams. They've been going through all the design meetings. They've gone through all the simulators. I'm sure they are 100% prepared and just excited to go today. It seems the third time's a charm after two previous launch attempts were scrubbed. This mission already about four years behind schedule, repeatedly grounded by software glitches, fuel valve and parachute problems. Hold, hold, hold. The last attempt on Saturday was called off with just four minutes to go because of a last minute computer issue with the U.S. LA Atlas V rocket. The vehicles were ready. We just happened to have, you know, an unlucky ground card problem. That has since been fixed, and the two astronauts have been in quarantine since to prevent any illness. The pair will test Starliner systems on the way to the International Space Station, about 250 miles above Earth. They will spend eight days in space before returning to the western U.S. Now, Starliner should reach the International Space Station tomorrow morning. The docking is expected around 11 a.m. Chicago time. And depending on conditions, the earliest possible return date would be June 14th.